we definitely need uh, women in economic empowerment if we want to, uh, you know, see these developing countries develop and grow their economy and uh, face all the challenges they have to face, like the demographic explosion in Africa and so on. So we all agree that we, we need economy, women economic empowerment. But we, if we want that, we need to keep girls in school. We need to provide education to girls. And one of the reasons why girls stop going to school in developing countries, it's either when they have their first period, because the infrastructures and the services and the understanding is not there, and, um, or because they, they, they're, they're pregnant. And pregnancy comes with either cultural norms or gender violence. Uh, so this is why we strongly believe that sexual and repro reproductive health and rights is so important. We have to protect girls. We have to educate boys and girls uh, to avoid girls uh, being pregnant too soon, uh, to avoid gender-based violence. So if we want to empower women economically, we definitely have to take care of the girls. We have to provide them you know, family planning services and contraception uh, so they can complete school, they can, uh, you know, they, they can have the control over their own body and make their own decisions uh, for themselves, for their family and for their community.